Hello everyone, this is Dean and Hendron here, bringing another episode of Monster Hunter World. This is the big one. Let's first check the canteen out, because I think it got upgraded if I remember last time. Ooh, it definitely seems to have. Maybe. I don't know. I've never seen this cutscene before, so that's cool. Yeah, it definitely seems upgraded. Um, But anyway... We're going to be facing the... Oh, Chef's Choice is always good, I think. I don't know. I, like, saw somewhere online somebody was saying, like, the Chef's Choice is good or something. So hopefully they're not lying. We'll find out. But anyway, we have to take on the T-Rex, which, I don't know. I've kind of been overhyping, I guess you could say. But we'll find out. Elemental resistance, because from what we've learned, it's going to be fire. Yep, the engine ant. We got this. Looks like a giant. You have a strange way of doing, of viewing things. I can say that much. Okay. Time expires, or we faint. Do not want multiplayer. For some reason, it has me actually online, which is fine, I guess, but. Um, whoops. Like, that's fine and everything. I don't want anybody in it, so we're going to make it one out of one party. But anyway. I could say T-Rex, they've it's been hyped up. I feel if we're going to have a first death anytime in the near future, this is going to be it. I'm very nervous about this guy. And like I said, maybe I'm overhyping it. Maybe we're just gonna go and be like, haha, and he's just like dead. But I'm I'm not seeing that happening. I'm seeing this being like a are we going to survive or not? It's going to be barely there. I don't know. It's going to be a close one. Very dangerous enemy. He does, I assume, a lot of damage. I mean, we haven't actually fought him. So. What has me worried, if he was a pushover we would have fought him before we went to the new area by putting him afterwards they're saying he's still a step above those other guys we were fighting and like the electric fox we fought last time was terrifying enough so let's see we got some throwing knives kind of wish they were poison throwing knives but yeah We'll make do. Oh, we have like no potions. I should have probably done something about that. I know everybody would be like crucifying me in the comments if I'm whining about no potions and walk by a freaking herb right there. Like that would have been. Ooh, that'd be embarrassing even for me. That is an advantage to spawning over on this side. Uh, water moss, I don't know how useful it will be against him, but it might be. Excuse me, I just need to get a few footprints. Don't want the stone, I'd rather keep the water moss. Okay, so these are old footprints of him, so he has not been over here recently. And this should be yep, max potions, so that's that's good. Oh, and some honey, that's even better. I will gladly trade two potions for some max potions. Hope there's some mucus up there. Let's get some needle berries. Uh, is there an easy way up there? I'm not seeing a spot to really climb, so we'll just have to ignore that mucus for right now. 
I want the footprint. Where's the... Let's not waste time with those guys. Oh, like the only thing those guys risk doing is damaging us. And he does. Come on. Okay, you know what? Screw it. You guys want to fight? There's your fight. In the future, do not bother me when I'm trying to mine stuff. By the way, it's funny because, like, they weren't difficult when we first had to fight them, but still, they were definitely not nearly as easy. Okay, so we got some ore. Alright, are you leading us now? Um, let me right quick use the whetstone. I know we barely did anything, but I need every ounce I can get. Bone pile, never know. Ancient bones. See, that's why it was worth checking, because ancient bones are actually really good. Did I? Yeah, we used the whetstone all the way. I was worried that I canceled it early, but it does not appear so. Where are the other footprints? Up ahead. Gotta get to... Okay, there's his mucus, which is kind of gross. Does he just go around sneezing everywhere or something? Okay, we've got a track on him. Like, on him specifically. Can we see it on the map? Is that... I don't know. He's not appearing on the map yet, but that's fine. These will take us straight to him. Unfortunately. <laughs> like I say, I'm not a fan of this guy. Trying to think, I believe we saw his head and his tail. His tail, I know, can be severed off, which we want to do that if possible. I think his head is also breakable and a weak point, so that's interesting. I don't know about you, but you would have to pay me a lot to be doing this. Like he's just playing with the great Jaggers like it's a chew toy or something. Smart move. Except for the part that you've just probably made it angry. Oh my god, he just threw a freaking Great Jagras at us. Oh my god. Um, he looks a lot more intimidating in person. Okay, that didn't hurt that much. don't even know how our health got that low already. Oh, he can swipe with his tail. That's unfortunate. What's he doing? Okay, he's charging. Oh god, this is not exactly what I was thinking. But it worked. It worked. Oh my! What is this? Okay, that hurt. That hurt a lot. That was a missed dodge there. That's the only reason we died there. Like, we shouldn't have gotten hit that quickly but 
It's fine. It's fine. I think we can get another canteen meal. Our mini canteen here serves food that will give you a boost for the hunt ahead. Yeah, it's... Just throw the raw meat in it. Oh, we've already eaten close enough. Okay. That was just me being stupid. Okay, well, where's our friend? I'm mad about that because I shouldn't have died there. I misdodged that end. Just bad play. But that... He looks intimidating, but... Even if his head is breakable, which apparently it is. Are we not, like, tracking? Okay, there we go. Even if his head is breakable, though, I don't know if I really want to try to break it. I'm going to be honest. Because that's putting you in a tricky situation, to say the least. How did I miss that? Okay, now he's ready to fight. Buddy. Yeah, how do you like that? You don't like it much, do you? Oh. Alright, yeah. Talking to you. Okay, so he's got a little jumping attack. There's the tail swipe. I didn't think I was that close to it. But I was. I'm trying to lock on the tail or whatever, but it's not working. Okay, he can kick. That's unfortunate. God, is there any place that he can't, like, instant destroy me from? Why is my health also so low? Is it because I lost the boost? I'm gonna guess it's because I lost the boost. From, like, the meal. I should have seen that coming. That was stupid. What's he doing? Oh. He is eating me. What the? Okay, he's leaving. Oh my god, I barely got any hits on him. I need a strategy or something. Um, let's see. Let's loot the bone pile. Okay, he can kill us with his tail. He can kill us with his mouth. It still seems like... Right in front of him is the most dangerous place to be, it would appear. Because he can do like a bit of a combo on us. So we still don't want to take him on like... Do I have... Um... Got those throwing knives. Gilly... Dun Gosh. I'm going to keep my uh, freaking... Bright Moss, maybe? That's something I can... Okay, maybe that'll be able... I, I want to blind him. That's my new strategy at the moment. Blind him. Who are you? First friends, okay.
But yeah, I want... Oh, there's a mining outcrop, and I missed it. And I need mining materials for certain upgrades. So. Oh, we didn't even get to freaking do the Great Jagras, like... The dead um, body the first time around. I wanted to freaking take advantage of that. Okay, the Bright Moss did not do what I was thinking. I was hoping it would do a blinding effect as well. Because that's what I need. I saw that coming too late. At least we have another little cat thing that decided to join us for some reason. It just does not take him. Tail swipe. Like, he takes no time at all to switch into an attack from a different direction. The head definitely is a weak point, though. Here comes the tail swipe. Okay, let's stay s smart. There's the lunge. Ah, that hit. I thought he was going to miss me. He's flared out again. That means he's... I'm assuming that means, like, back up or something, because... Oh, he ran away. Nice. Much better fight on him that time. Still, like... You can just tell by how little we lost sharpness, we, we're not doing much hits on him. Okay, I don't want to fight you guys because you're a waste of time. Where are we going? Where are we going? Flies. Flies? Oh, we're in combat, so they're not going to show me. I think he went this way. Oh, I can see him on the map, too, so I have a rough idea. Now the flies will lead us, though. So. Yeah, like I say, um, the key there, we didn't take much excess damage. Oh, that stunned him a bit. Oh, he did a 360 on us. I thought the tree was going to protect me. Oh, but he's trapped too. Potion, please drink faster. God, we had him trapped too, but I couldn't risk it. So luring him into a tree does work well, though. What are these attacks he's doing? That had to hurt a bit, right? I couldn't get away from it. It didn't do much damage, though. We're fine. Oh, was that fire? 
I do not like if he's going to start using fire. Part broken. His foot or something. Okay. This is a much preferred area to fight him now. At least it feels like it. Like, it's more open. I like the open area to fight him. Take a pot shot at him. Oh my god, he can do freaking straight up fire breath. No, he's weak too. Like, he's fatigued. Like, he can barely move, and I'm not getting hits on him out of it. There we go. That was two hits. I want this tail severed. Like, that's the big thing. I don't know if it'll actually be that important. God, my stamina's so low. Oh, he's running. Okay, that's fine. Really good fight there. He's not limping, though, so he's not weakened much. Come on. Like, we've done damage to him, but not enough to make him be limping around, so he's tired, is all. Which I'll take tired. I mean, you saw how much easier that was once he was freaking having to catch his breath. He couldn't attack us. and Gosh, I hate we had him trapped that time. And we couldn't afford to, like, um, take full advantage. Because of... I was low health as well. If I'd known that my, um... Little guy was going to frickin'... Oh, he was ready for us. Looks like he had his breather. Rather unfortunate. There we go. Okay, I don't like when he's in a small area. We don't want him in a narrow space. That's when things go really bad for us in a hurry. Okay, just keep avoiding for a minute. We'll get health back slowly. Okay, now's where we gotta be careful. Okay. Dodge that. No, he fell. Gosh, that... If we lose this fight at any point, we've... We gotta hold ourselves responsible because we talk about missed opportunities. Luckily, he's probably upset about his missed opportunities as well. Okay, got some... Like, we've hit his tail a good bit, actually. Awesome, we knocked his tail off. I want him to leave now. Would really appreciate you leaving, T-Rex, so I can collect from your tail. We wasted a bit of a mega potion there. 
we didn't need need to use, but okay, we got his tail. Now we really want to win this. Like even more so than before. I didn't even get to see if he's limping or anything, so it's a bit of a disappointment. Unfortunately, now with his tail gone, that's a weak point we can't exploit. So, bit of a disadvantage to knocking his tail off, I suppose you could say. Okay, we have full antidotes, so that's good if we run into more poison enemies in the future. Latchberries, forget what they do. Oh yeah, pierce ammo, useless. I was pretty sure they were useless, but... I'm hoping the An Anjanath guy is going to his nest, because that would mean that he's getting tired, I think. Nope, he is not tired. God, he's just... Like, that was... That was not fair, buddy. Watch out, because he has a long-range fire breath, as we saw before as well. Ah, oh, he still has enough of a tail. Oh, I thought he was done. I didn't know he was going to combo there. Crap. needed health there. Okay. Let's be smart. I don't want to... Put out the fire. Haven't got many chances to use that on him. Because it's kind of risky. Whoa, he moved fast there. Oh, if I could get him over here. Make him drowsy. I think that's what it'll do. Didn't seem to work. Okay, let's do some big damage here. This is a weak point, too, I think. That had to hurt his foot. Opie's mad he flared out on us again. Can't see. Yep, he's running. He's limping. Get more red pits. Uh, where were where the herbs? Ah, may as well max out our regular potions because we might need them in a second here. We've almost got him though, and we only have died one time. Hope I don't jinx that. We've knocked his tail off. We've been really giving him a hard time. He's almost dead. Or at least he's weak. Oh, honey. Where's the honey? Yep, there it is. More Mega Potions. I feel like Mega Potions are mandatory right now just because he can do a lot of damage very, very fast on us. And I'm not in the mood for fighting with that right now. Let's not run out of stamina. As long as we don't totally choke, I think we can beat this guy, though. Like, I'm very happy with how we've been doing the last few times. Don't run out of stamina. Yeah, but he is, like, he is on the door to death right now. Oh, old scale. Pick it up. It's something new. We might be above him. 
Oh, he's still moving. Crap, I thought he was like chilling around here. Where where is he going? Buddy, I just want to finish you off. Be done with you. And see if we get like cool armor or something from you. Oh, he's asleep. He's asleep. Wanted to get that off on him to start with. Sword is fully charged. He fell over. He is screwed. Let's do it once more. Take advantage of all like that damage we can put on him. What move is this? Nope. Get away from the mouth. Don't know why he keeps going for him, but that's fine. Oh, he cut us off in the middle of that. Uh-oh, fire, fire. Take a potion, I'm not risking this. Here comes the big fire. Yup, I didn't think that could hit me through the tree there. I thought it was safe. Big mistakes. Come on. Uh-oh, uh-oh. There's a lot of uh-ohs. No! No, that just like killed all of our health. God, he's so close too. Like I couldn't move out of the way enough and... God, like half a second more and our freaking cat was going to have us saved. Can I eat now? Yeah, I'm going to take defense up medium. Okay, so... I believe... We only get, like, one more shot. If I remember right. I think it said faint three times and it's game over. So... He's weak. But... As he showed, that doesn't mean that he is not ready to fight. Like, I had potions too and everything. It's just he freaking comboed me into oblivion. With the fire. Fire is definitely a difficult element to deal against, I would say. I mean, I guess I should just be freaking relieved that I have the fire resistance that I do have. Is he still in his nest? Yeah. Is he going to go back to sleep? Nope. Okay, get away. Not messing around here. That usually means a charge is coming. Uh, no. Ah, tail swipe. Should have seen that coming. Oh, here it comes again. Nope, wait. Don't want to fight him in that area. 
Watch for the quick turnaround that he can do. Opie is not happy. No, he's running. Okay. Let me use one of these. Just trying to think of everything, because I don't want to use a full potion for this when I have a lot of health left. Yeah, and sorry if I'm not talking as much there in some of this. I'm really scared of... Oh. No. You've got to be kidding. I mean, he's going to freaking obliterate him. Holy crap. I just don't want him to see us and decide, heh heh heh. Is he leaving? Like, are they done fighting, or... Sure doesn't look like it. God, that did a number on T-Rexy here. What is he doing? Like, he... I have never seen the T-Rex get owned by something like that. That's kind of hype. I didn't get the jumping attack on the T-Rex. That would have been, like, I think the end of him if we could have got the jumping attack. Okay, I was thinking it was probably one hit away just because the, um... Rathian just d destroyed him for us. Let's get the bone pile. And then see what awesome loot we get from the T-Rex. We did it, though! We died twice, but that's acceptable. We didn't fail the mission. Let's hope we get good stuff here. Some scales. Some pelt. Nose bone. And we got tail earlier, so... I'd say that's a success. Oh my god, I did not think we were going to be able to take this guy down. He doesn't look so tough now. And yes, I'll admit it, we got really, really lucky. I mean, he was already weakened, but the Rathian just freaking came and took care of everything for us. Like, he's just like, you know, I've had enough of this. Flame sacks, yes, a bunch of tail, ancient bones, iron, monster bone. Okay, nothing too great from the palico, but that was good. And I feel like we got a lot of stuff out of it as well. Like as far as anduranth materials. Almost leveled that up again too. Achievements, defender, right. New upgrade level is now available for armor. Gosh, it's just... The whole game is celebrating that we did that. <laughs> I think that's the f only time I'm ever going to be happy to see Rathian show up. Like, freaking, what's he doing here? Like, uh, that was... That was fun, though. And once again, we still have not fooled on a mission yet. Like, we were getting close there with the three. Like, we fainted twice or whatever, so. Although the first one was really cheap. Like, the first one was just me screwing up. Shouldn't have happened that soon. Uh, what's going on? There's a lot of cannons. Were those there before?
and I've just not noticed much. Gather around, people. We have much to discuss. Are we going to have a celebratory feast for my great victory? All our preparations are complete. Of course not. All of you to thank for working double time to make it happen. Like somebody taking on a T-Rex one on one. I'm especially impressed with the fifth. Yeah. Hunting the Anjanath despite being new here. It wasn't that difficult. That's one less misery standing between us and capturing Zora Magdaros. Well done. Anytime, buddy. Anytime. When will Zora reach the Great Ravine? Precisely at daybreak. Good. That's convenient. Let's run through the operation one last time. Then. Yeah, because I kind of missed the operation the f all the other times. Our hunters will rendezvous on site. Okay, Once that's me. Appears, the operation will commence. Okay. We've built two barriers in the target's path. That's kind of impressive. Your objective is to stop it at the first barrier. Initially wearing it down with cannon and ballista fire, then restrain it with binders. Is it going to be cool with being shot by cannons and ballistas? Or is it going to get really mad and, like, kill all of us? However, there is a chance it will break through. If so, we'll initiate the mounting phase of, course. of the operation. I, I don't like this plan. At all. This phase, we'll attempt to weaken it further, so that we'll have a better chance of restraining it at the second barrier. Okay. Make sure you hammer it as much as possible with cannons and ballista. They're there for a reason. Affirmative, sir. Technicians, make sure you do a final check on the equipment before we begin. Yeah, uh, definitely make sure the equipment's working. Quartermasters, conduct an inventory on our supplies. Researchers, proceed to the Great Ravine with your escort as soon as you're ready. We can't bring our quarry back to base, so take what you need and be prepared to conduct your research on site. All right. Sorry, Commander. Everything will be in order. I hope so. Open during the operation. I'll be giving orders as the situation unfolds. Is that code for he's not going to actually do anything useful? Because that's definitely what it sounds like. This is why you want to be in a leadership position. Okay, well. Wow, the big moment is finally here. I'm shaking up a storm here. How about you? Uh, I'm more wanting to turn in my bounties and stuff and. Go to the smithy and see. I mean, I'm kind of upset. We we killed like the big giant monster, and nobody. They're just like, good job. Now, uh, on to the next thing. Like, we don't even get a chance to freaking celebrate. We should be having a party or something. In my honor. Um, register bounties. Okay, we need two more. Birds. I'm going to go mining out crops and... Bone piles. Do I have something I can complete? Oh, I do. Good job, me. Okay, let's talk to this guy. Go carefully. Blah blah blah. Heck yeah, we upgraded it. What did we learn about him? Only level two. Whoops. So we knew his weak points, which don't help that much. Oh, we learned what we can carve from him. Okay. That's useful, I guess. Like, pretty soon I'm going to actually have to start farming some of the monsters we've killed, I feel. Because I want to make some of the gear, but you're not going to get enough stuff to make, as we've seen, like anything. Just by going through it once and killing them, so. I'm going to have to start farming monsters. Although the T-Rex is one of those I don't want to farm yet, because it was... A bit of a struggle just from the get-go. Okay, as usual, let's check our axes. The Jagras axe, we still can't upgrade. The bone axe, we can't upgrade it yet, but we know what we can upgrade it to now. And we just need some more bones. Boulder bone and some medium bones. But do that and we can upgrade that. And it'll be 490. Holy crap. That would be a big upgrade. On the other hand, 
On the other hand, we could at least potentially make a madness axe at some point if we farm the Juratoridus or whatever. And then we'd have a water element weapon. I, I kind of want to have an elemental weapon. Oh my god. 455, rarity 3, and fire element 180. Oh my god, I want to make one of those now. <laughs> Unfortunately, we'd have to get a lot more material, but that's... God, it also looked kind of cool, I think, too. Yeah, that's a pretty cool looking axe. Okay, let's see what new armor we can make, actually. Oh my god, we can't make any of his armor except the leg piece, which gives artillery, which is useless to... Oh, it also gives us this. Temporarily reduce stamina depletion. That's good to know. So it gets multiple things? Oh, it's a set bonus. Okay, I see now. I'm, I'm not that dumb. Sorry. Okay, that gives us fire resist, which you could expect. 20 base defense. That's a big upgrade. This gives us special ammo boost, which uses marathon runner. Now, this would be something. And I kind of like the color scheme of it. Wouldn't mind having some of that. How would we look if we had the full armor? I don't know. The, the coloration, I'm not a huge, huge fan of. What I think I kind of almost want is full, like... It, I, I kind of like that, except the headpiece is not great. But we need a lot more. Like, I'd have to farm some Kadashis for it. But, I don't know. Like I say, I'm not sure... Oh, I can preview the whole sets instantly. That's cool. Whoa, that's weird. That's weird, too. See, I don't like the overly bulky armors. I like the Kadashi and the Anja just because they're not overly bulky. Like, look at this. That one's a little bulky, the shoulder blades. But this thing, like, eh, I don't know. Anyway... I'm talking about useless stuff. We can't really make much of anything, even though we got a pretty good amount of stuff. I do want to... Um... That's the first... The new thing we've unlocked is the first thing that actually has a set bonus, which means, obviously, you get that for wearing a full set. So, might have to keep that in mind, but... Anyway, I'm going to quit worrying about that. We're going to end this episode here. Very successful episode. I honestly was worried that I was going to have to like try it a few times and then give up or something and go farm previous monsters to get equipment to make better armor and weapons, maybe with an element or something to take this guy out. Like I was I was way overselling this guy. I know we got a little lucky with the freaking Rathian showing up, but anyway, thank you so much for watching. Next episode, we will do whatever that thing is. I think we'll actually be going after the big molten dragon thing from the start of the game. So if you enjoyed it, please um, leave a comment down below, subscribe if you want to see more from the channel, and thank you so much for watching, and I will see you next time.